one. Okay, so today we're going to talk about alphonic. Now, alphonic is something that you're going to use when you are processing your podcast. So after you've done your editing and a tool like Audacity, and you've gotten out all the mistakes and so forth, but you want some nice processing and you want to put in some information in your podcast, then at that point, you're going to want to go to Alphonic. So Alphonic is a free service. They give you up to two hours a month of processing. So you're going to type in Alphonic.com. And then once you sign up, it's going to take you to this screen. You're going to tell it you want a new production. You can make presets if you decide that you want to uh, have a regular podcast series. Or uh, you can just go ahead and choose your file. If you want, uh, you can set it up so that it will automatically pull off intro and outro music and so forth. Um, although we haven't done that. You could do that with Dropbox. That's like a topic of another video, though. Uh, you want to put in the title of your podcast here uh, so whatever you you know you want your podcast to be titled here so we're going to call this one and then you put your name here under the artist uh, you don't need to fill in everything else album track so forth subtitle just a little short uh, subtitle whatever you think's appropriate to your podcast summary this is actually really long so you could actually write up a couple of paragraphs if you want of a summary and just paste them right in here. The uh, publisher, you can put in yourself, you can put in a URL and so forth. Uh, tags, you can type in some tags here. So you might wanna put in whatever you want is appropriate. Just put in a couple of commas here. Uh, as many or as few as you want. Now the output file, there's there's a couple of different ways of approaching this. It depends on really how big of a file do you do you really want. So as you can see here, the the higher the quality of the file, the bigger it's going to get. Uh, 141 megabytes per hour versus 14 megabytes per hour. I I would probably bring mine down anywhere from 112 to 96, somewhere in this range. That's what I've heard a lot of sort of uh, career or, or really, in, you know, professional or enthusiastic podcasters like to do around the 96 range, although there's not one answer to this. You can make it mono if you want to save a little bit more room in your file. I would probably leave the leveler normalization and filtering alone. You might also want to add noise and hum reduction. That's up to you. I would leave this on auto. Where do you want to put this? Um, probably it's 16 to 19, somewhere in this range. There's a couple of debates among podcasters about what is the appropriate number. They're recommending 16 here. I think that's fine. You can save it or you can go ahead and start the production. Uh, and if you start the production, it's going to, now this is a very short, short, short video, which is why it uploaded almost instantaneously. I mean, I think it's like 30 seconds long i intentionally chose a very very short file to show you sort of how the processing works if you've got a long file it it, it might take you um oh there's not a right answer anywhere from let's say a minute for every eight to ten minutes you have this is incredibly short though which is why you can see that it's right here and then it shows you um, you know the track and whatnot this is only a 30 second clip here it's really just a song and then you download it, and there you go. And that's it. You can include an image in there. Uh, there's a spot for, and, and you know, you may not realize all the magic it's sort of doing behind the scenes, but it's, it's sort of taking the loudness, it's normalizing it out, it's fixing the range. It, it's just cleaning things up, so it's gonna give you a nicer audio sound. And for a free product and service, there's really no reason not to do that. It also is going to allow you to embed your, your podcast image, your podcast summary descriptions, and so forth. So you have all that in there. And that's all phonic, and that's all it is.